Well, we do receive voicemails here at the core. You can call us 24 hours a day and leave your voicemail on our system. The number is 833-THE-CORE. That's 1-833-843-2673. Here's a voicemail from one of our listeners named Jennifer. I listen to you almost daily at lunchtime, and I have a question. If we are made in God's image, then why are we so prone to sin and to evil and to pride? If God's perfect and we're made in his image, why aren't people better in general? Why do they turn evil? That's my Mm. question. Thank you. Bye. Yeah, thank you for that question. We do believe that all people are made in God's image. Such a beautiful thing. And you know what uh, is amazing is you don't have to be a Christian really to fully grasp this. I mean, a lot of people who reject the Christian faith, maybe they wouldn't even call themselves, you know, believers in God at all. We we still have this this sense of the dignity of human life and human beings. Now, of course, you know, we're losing that in a lot of places, and you see this through the abortion industry and and other uh, avenues as well. But most people, even if you're talking to somebody who isn't a Christian and you, you said to them, right, shouldn't all people be loved and respected and treated with dignity? They, they say, yeah, we're not just, we're not just, you know, uh, we're not just roadkill, right? We're, we're human beings and there's something unique about that. And indeed there is. Well, what is it that's, that's unique? What is it that sets the human race apart from, from the rest of the creatures? It's the fact that we are made in the image of a loving God. And having been made in the image of God, you see this in Genesis chapter 2, having been made in the image of God, we are called as human beings to reflect God, his goodness, his holiness, his grace, his love. We're called to, to, to love his creation, to, um, to take care of it, to rule in one sense as, as God himself is the great king and ruler. Now, why is it that we, made in the image of God, are so sinful. Um, why, why is it that we hurt each other and sin against each other? Why is it um, that there is so little beauty in the way we interact with one another? Well, it's not because of something wrong in God's creation, in, in what he did. It's because of something in us, sin in our own hearts, the, the entrance of sin into the world. And when sin entered the world, it was like this disease, this sickness that infected everyone. And so while we're called to image God, to reflect him, to glorify him by loving him and by loving each other, what has happened is the opposite. Now, instead of loving God and worshiping him, we worship the creature rather than the creator, oftentimes ourselves. Now, instead of loving each other, um, we have become lovers of self. And that's why God sent his son, Jesus, into the world, the true image of God, that he might restore that image of God in us in knowledge, righteousness, and holiness. Not that we, we lost it. Everyone's made in the image of God. But only through Jesus can we live as God calls us and know God as he wants us to. And so may God bless you to that end.